Swear to God and three other white men, I'm good. <laughs> I don't get too big a break in the show, but it's because I talk about sex and being Negro. You're not supposed to talk about sex, but hell, Negroes have sex. Did nobody draw us? Slide. <laughs> yeah. I like the clever song I've just composed. Oh, yeah. A lot of you don't know probably that I'm a songwriter. I've had quite a few hits. This latest one I think will be a big one. Yo. 
I'm best described as the father of sex and lies. I specialize in undressing wives, but I recognize when it's time to pull my cock out the hot house. Cause I don't want no seeds left inside, so instead I'll catch her eyes with a wet surprise from the yogurt slinger and poke a finger up her ass until the motion stings her. Depending on how close it brings her to the point of climax, that's when I get romantic with the face to join in my lap. Slide. How would you like to get fucked in the butt? I know you probably love to get covered with nut, and I could cover your mouth with enough of the stuff. Whenever my muffle of bust, that if you breathe, then you smother your lungs. Yeah. Ew, what you mean? You ain't hide your feel? I splash a grill like lighter fluid at a family meal. Or a lesbian's face with badges ill when she bites into it. I'm cool to you, dyke slut. You know you like to do it. Playing in pornos when I'm stuffing tubes, taking a cornhole. If I'm late for one more show, cause I spend my labels, paper on more hoes, they'll probably take me straight to a court show. But instead of getting screwed on TV, I'd rather fuck cuties. Unless, of course, Judge Judy's in the mood to eat me. I usually use my CD to abuse the treaty of sex between me and my ex and feed a spoojin' treaty. And you should see me when the semen's flowing, spewing freely. I squeeze a load in the throat till the chicken's cheeks are swollen. Cause if a beak is showing, then she gets the worm, catching cock at every turn with extra sperm till the lessons learned. I'm less concerned. Term of closed nails and a precious perm As long as I avoid infectious germs and a breast of firm And when I'm trying to fuck your chicken Call a whole slut of bitches just for kicks So it's not a sexist term <laughs> Now what starts with the letter C? <laughs> Stuck in the kitchen, I like stuffing a dick in her ass when she's touching a kitten. I like to fucking forget him and try a dozen positions, then serve the mic a sermon like writing smuts of religion. I pay homage to bondage and goodwill to fill, and stay up in the prime dress with stats like Will to Still. And in the process, I like to turn women to objects, penthouse to henhouse, or birds living in projects. I don't discriminate on the basis of race or the place that you stay. There's hardly a chick I won't inseminate. I spread the legs of college chicks, featherweight and solid chicks. I make them face the snake, but I'll never taste the bottom lips. I poke them with the obelisk and flee from the scene let me explain and you'll see what i mean cause as much as i love pussy you can't feed it to me no why i don't need anything that bleeds for a week and don't die I'm punching a clock, carrying my lunch in a box So don't ever assume that my life is something that's not Shit, I got a nine to five, despite the fact that I'm as live As any jerk-off cat that's signed a job My boss is trying to drive me out my treehouse For at least three hours a day, he's chewing me out For two to three thousand a month, they don't pay me enough To spend my work day taking the stuff this jerk say I ain't working overtime I'm trying to hear my name on MTV well, News up in Kurt Loder's line So I work over rhymes and I'm behind in my paperwork I'm late for work cause I spend my nights chasing skirts My measly check don't make it worth the stress that hurts my chest Not to mention I'm immersed in debt to the top of a turtleneck Pissing them on it, but why should anyone listen to me when I don't listen to no one? Consider this is an omen, I could go berserk at any moment Like a mailman fed up with postal work I went from happy to nasty like a bipolar jerk To shoot him down the lounge with a fine Folgers perks Punch in, punch out, punch in I've been looking for a building with a nice window to jump out Feeling self-destructive, sick of the daily grind Lately I felt disruptive and I think it's mailman time Day in, day 
out. It seems like there's no way out. I pulled a 12 gauge out and shot off 28 rounds. And watch the pellets spreading out, killing my associates. My boss is gonna get it now and find out what Post Malone is. Good morning, Mr. Schwartz. Good morning, Lewis. You've been late three times this month already. I believe this is the fourth. <laughs> I don't want you missing four, and it's probably more. You're not counting the times I didn't sign the time sheet on the lobby right. floor. Well, if you feel your job secure, keep it up there. Apparently, someone hasn't had his coffee and he needs a Perhaps muffin. you need a brief discussion, a policy refresher. And where's your progress? No, oh, I forgot that on my dresser. Well, if this case is too much pressure, we can ease the tension. Starting today, you forfeit your pay and take a week's suspension. You really should prioritize. You can't stay up all night like some college guy bathing in beer like it's a party Look, life. I'm sorry I've been screwing up. I know I got the perfect job, but I've been working hard on this music stuff. Well, Lewis, you need a good job. And I know this one can be tough, but rapping isn't real work, and it can be just as Man, hard. what you trying to stop me from being a star? <laughs> you don't even play an instrument. Yeah, I don't need a guitar to season all right, these Settle down now. There's no need for alarm. Try and remain calm. Oh, I like this fucking office of a gun's fire and napalm. You're just another asshole who wants to see me dressed up in my dad's clothes, working underpaid until I'm mad old. As far as that goes, you'll never live to see it take place. I brought a little present for you in my attaché case. Watch it. Watch out. Watch it. Watch I've been looking for a building with a nice window to jump out. Feeling self-destructive? Sick of the daily grind? Lately I felt disruptive and I think it's mailman time. Day in. Day out. It seems like there's no way out. I pulled a 12 gauge out and shot off 28 rounds and watched the pellets spreading out, killing my associates. My boss is gonna get it now and find out what postal is. And so it seems we act a bit like children. We play the games and call a few names. Sometimes I wonder who's the blame for it all. Well, now. Yeah. Like, oh, no. If you drank so much that you don't react to an awkward bad across your bony 